feels great to have you back. So then, did you all hear about that Arasaka aircraft carrier docked in Night City called Kujira or the Whale? Okay. So last night we did that. So we could basically. Now we're only using the black unicorn until we get some of the other ones. Um, what is the? I don't remember what the button is to. B. Or alt, looks like. Double tap alt. Okay. That's fine. Okay. real reason just because we can um honestly a lot of these are gonna probably be that we need to do some of the main story first So I suppose we could head to Lizzie's bar. Large part of what I like to do is really not even deal with the main story at all. And just do side quest stuff. Like this. It's not setting properly. There we go. All right. Consumable X. Ricochet uh. weapons. Yeah, I couldn't remember what the fucking button was. Sandiviston. Um. Uh, required level four, which would explain why I almost fucking died. Hey, Pon. No worries. Um, inventory. Shards. 
area. There. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Figures. Hey there, doll face. Interest you in a preem BD? Not my first time. Don't remember you. Because I didn't get in through the front. Ha, huh, get a load of this one. Right. Rules are simple. Someone catches your eye, you do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. No recording, no cop and feels when the guards ain't looking. In you go. Have fun, doll. Welcome to Lizzie's. Have fun, doll. My, what a sweet little face you have. Get you something. Oh, that's so good. Water. So curious. The name Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Oh, now I'm just flat interested. Real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Nah, uh, stories of the golden days. Inevitable demise and the inevitable drink over sweet memories. Tall what makes the tall tales easier to swallow. So, what went wrong? Tiger Claws shot up Lizzie. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. Gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Hi, Sean, Tigers how gave you this doing? place up to the mocks in the end, though, didn't they? Sort Hope of. you're having a wonderful had to weekend. Make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn. Club's big. Gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. <laughs> Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Is 
scents on. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Yeah, Actually, that cake emblem much is like cool. Your thing, this place. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. So. What can a horny Nothing girl wrong. like me really? do for a hungry? Why don't you just tell me the truth? Eleanor, I just you know told you. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. No idea if Dex exaggerates. A little, a lot. You got me. Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. Come on. Can't leave that hanging. Headhunters. They lay their trust elsewhere. Not in people, but in a thing. Their intuition. They bet on potential. And if they lose that bet, it's the last mistake they ever make. I'm hoping Dex's intuition has served him well in this case. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Arasaka seems to have quite the touch with that hotel chain. But I gotta say, Compeki and Tokyo's still leagues above the rest. Uh, the two are identical to each other. Japan's staff. The service can't be beat. Singapore, Paris, Washington. Ugh, all the rest act like charity case cousins by comparison. Well, it's hard to argue with that, true. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? In Night City? Huh. Guess the scream sheets weren't lying this time. It's on the lips of everyone in the city. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son, heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire, in town. <laughs> Please. Could it be? Empress prepared to cede his throne after 150 years? Doubt it. Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Nope, don't buy it. Netwatch's integrity rests on their neutrality. Why would they tarnish their rep by procuring stolen goods? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game. 
and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Heard a bit about Yorinobu. Studied finance and biotech in Tokyo, probably to please his father. Mm-hmm. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu cut himself off from the corp. Joined the Steel Dragons, Nomads, from Tokyo. Heard they were planning an Arasaka coup or its downfall. Hmm. That flash of youthful rebellion ended like it usually does. Yorinobu returned to the fold, but the bitter taste remained. You know your stuff. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has his own designs on the corp. Could be another power-hungry corpo dick. Like so many others. <laughs> Ever tried to imagine what life might be like for an emperor's son? You have everything. Yet you are no one. Nothing. At least as long as you remain in Saburo Arasaka's shadow. I... sympathize. It's a vulnerability I understand well. And one you plan to exploit fully. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits, jacking off to in those boxes. Wow, don't cry. You no, got this, though. it can be a very Ooh, useful yeah, sure. tool. Sure. But for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Uh -oh. Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. Yon what are you doing? I'm looking around. Give me a second. Uh-huh. Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. <clears throat> hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make Hey, Judy. Compiled your BD yet? What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, have dealt with worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. 
Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no beady virgin, but the raw stuff, uncharted territory. Relax, I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. I haven't quite decided the way I want to play this character yet. In terms of like conversation pieces and Gotta stuff. Gotta create your sensory profile first. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. <coughs> now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Get a lot of requests like this? All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn tuning. Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking's business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander to the grocery list, spouses' birthdays, late bills, whatever. But even then, you can refigure things, mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now, let me see. Where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. We got something here. Should be perfect. Won't take long. Be diving in in three, two, one. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Everybody, on the ground! I wanna see you kissing the flooring! Muddy, now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa, yeah, uh, hey! Uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off! Yeah, it's impressive, right? Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. Think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hi, Cable Spark. How you Running doing? From the crew. Security special. Is this your so first you playthrough? While we kind of. No problem, I hope. I haven't Actually, fully finished the game before. That Not helps. What we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional. Discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Please. I'm glad Judy. you're doing good. I hope you uh, have a wonderful weekend. I never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn. They're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. 
Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen. Need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request... now. Got it. You ready? I'm Milisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. Taking a sweet old fucking time. I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> you look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn, she... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. To... Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Okay. Uh, in the audio layer, uh, editing mode. Um, switch layer. There we go. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. Uh, I am going for a katana build. Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Uh, playback mode. Switch layer. Wind. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds. Uh, I'm acid. probably going to be going berserk rather than the Sandavistan. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling, servers, gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Fancy doodads. Wish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need to make it feel never. The taste have boosted somehow? We have nope. not seen Just eye to price. eye for the past Same 20 years. Be sipping in real space soon. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. 
The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no. provide them. Enough. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense. Edgy. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. Oh, got it. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally? No way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here. Here yeah, already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, oh, you'll like this. Um, editing mode. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Manual details a special temp controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, Chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Uh, rewind. Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. To such things. You will listen to this. Utterly removed from. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. You really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. From reality. Stuck inside fossilized vision of a world. That no longer may never be seen. We'll, 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 Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Your Nobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We've got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. There we go. Get everything you need? Yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. 
I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. We needed that recording, Judy. BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? So, what now? V, do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You want to fuck over our fixer. I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows and actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that'll cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay, for sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Okay. Man, that's a lot. I forgot how much fucking dialogue is in this game. Ah, <sighs> okay. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that ship without that bot. To work then, Miss V. The game story is fantastic, though. Yeah, um, I've only gotten maybe 75% of the way through. Come on in.
diary. Just keep me posted. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, that's right. We still have an attribute to level. Um, it was really when you start Johnny stuff. It's when it really gets good. Yeah, Johnny stuff is definitely good. Um, Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Transport fuck-ups toxic for you, I know. So listen carefully. You and me are gonna meet. See if we can't find a way to help each other out. Mutual self-interest. Agreed. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Riding bikes in this is really the only thing that I will drive. Driving over all is supposed to be coming. Yeah. Yeah. I'm honestly, I'm excited because the the overhaul is going to also overhaul combat as well and uh, the skill trees and stuff. Look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call. That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, bitch? Set conditions? Got any more for me? Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly, are you here alone? Come on! I'll tell you who's alone. You. Fail to recover that transport, and you're done. With not a soul willing to help. Not another word. Do a sweep, now. Now listen close. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Got no ties to Militech. None. Checks out. So how the fuck do you know so much? Come on, all corps use the same playbook. I know the game inside out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <laughs> Her, you can let go. Wanna hear what she has to say? Couldn't have been chill from the start? Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. <laughs> I need a bot.
flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Not the kind of subtlety they teach at Militech. Chip spiked with a virus, clearly. That is true. Something goes wrong. I'm the one they'll fill full of holes, not you. Time you were straight with me. What's on there? A tracing algorithm. Latches on to financial streams. Nothing you need to worry your head about. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to. I never did that in my playthrough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Yeah, I've gone corpo. Kind of the feel for a melee ninja. So. Um, removes the wal malware. I'm gonna remove it rather than make a copy of it. Five one C E nine. Fuck me in any way, and, and I'll be seeing you or clean. real soon. You're making a mistake! This cut's already good as dead! But she'll take you down with her! Um, I try to use the the uh, the corpo dialogue as much as I can to my advantage. I still haven't quite figured out how I want to play this character in terms of like dialogue. Do I want to go the shut the fuck up and answer my questions type of person? Or do I want to go complacency? One is a little bit easier than the other in terms of the routes that it takes you through. Corpo is always the best option. Yeah. I've done the Nomad. I don't think I did the, um, the hip hop druggy guy or whatever. Um, but I've done a uh, lot of corporate playthroughs. Let me hear what you squared away. I just never actually finished the story. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Ijole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Forget it, Jack. It'll be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast den. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. <sighs> I hate these Borg fuckers. Uh, that... Before I do that, I want to make sure I have... I only have two max stocks, so... I'll have to... 
start collecting max stocks. Had to be save the game real quick. Um, for now, I'm just using the black unicorn, but I do plan on grabbing uh, Satori. Um, primarily just due to its stats and everything. Just a gang like any other, right? I think the Valentinos, they follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. Uh, it's the one that's in um, the top of uh, Yorinobu's uh, penthouse, where the two guards are up by the helipad. Hey! Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. Place. Could use a few plants, though. So mad I didn't know about that. Yeah, um, oh, yeah. there have been multiple different um, over t over the last like year or two. There have been multiple ways of getting back in uh, to Compeki Plaza to go and get it after you've already done that they mission. Look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a Jow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Shit. I meant to equip it, not uh, go buy it like that. Uh... Thermal of resistance, we'll go with that for now. Where's this lead? Oops. Mm. That's back, that's good. Some food. The videos about the but I just didn't bother yeah I went back because I was just uh, <clears throat> I went back to try and see if I could do it and one of the times I did do it but now I just make sure every time I do the mission I just make sure to actually go through and get it before jumping off so that I don't miss it. Stay cool. They're just trying to spook us. Get in the elevator! Fucking sheep! Get in the elevator, fucking sheep. Should be. Remember, we're on their turf. So what do you want? You got a bot. Model MT-0 D-12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid Brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. <laughs> now couch, planet. Name's Dum Dum. Makako's katana is pretty good. Well, shit. Goes for you too. I'll stand. 
The hell you will. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass down Jack, for a planet. Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but. Shit. <laughs> well, alright. Come on. Not lighten up. Take a hit. can talk. Here we go. The Flathead. Model NT0 D12. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid out. Brick got it. <sighs> I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Fuck brick then. Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. All right, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. I'm talking. Relax. Got him right here. Just like that, without batting a fucking eye. <laughs> I hand over the chip. You hand over the bot. Clean and easy. No complications. Look at this fucking girl scout. You know all your nods. Got all your badges. <laughs> you know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> Man, he ain't good. Call me a rat! Dead. You hear? Yeah. Oh, no. oh, no. oh, no. This will be interesting. <laughs> Cut off. Grab the gear. Bot and control shard. Quick! Gotta find a way out of here. Gotta make sure we get everything. I'll check out gear and everything once we're done. Actually, that's a good point. I wanted to have a look. Can I see his... Burton Militech file, possible buyer... I mean, I don't need you, but you're nice to have. 
Also, what's up here? Nothing. Man. The fuck is it? It's a door, but it's just not one that I can go through. Fine. Okay. Does he have any... Any idea how we could do that? Armored shutter. There's no way we're getting through that. Old-ass factory, though. There's bound to be tech tunnels and shafts and shit all over the place. Can't hurt to try. Got the set. Bot and controller. And let's go. Quicker the better. All right. Perks. Reflexes. Blades. Um. What is that? Oh, counterfeit documents. Is that it? Yeah. Ah, uh, that's that's why that's where we go up. Hey, well it failed. It's deep. Ah, I could taste it. <laughs> um, strength mitigation. Armadillo. I mean, it'll do. I'll put those it's two a back in my, line. uh... Plus, I thought you loved meat. Really no other way. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved meat. Save. I am a uh, Ooh, good. avid saver. Let's go. So I will save a shit ton in an oh, hour no. just so I don't lose progress. Disinfectant. Resistant armadillo. Matter of time, motherfucker. Needs rifle ammo. Oh shit! Ladies and gentlemen, right. Jackie Wells. That's fine with me. So just. Boop, 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 boop. Um, boop, boop. Where'd you go? Boop. Jackie. Fuck. I'm stuck in shit. Quick hack experience from turning off all of the <laughs> uh, cameras. 
loot everything. How are you still alive? Next stock. game again because that would have been a nice trick to know. <laughs> Here somewhere. Messages. Or no BD. Um. Oops, wrong button. Oh wait, I think it's in. One of the shards. Thought I might have been one one of the shards, but I guess not. Um Detonator. Armed. Okay. Disarm the detonator. Now we just need to find... Ah. Remote deactivation. God, felt like a fucking eternity, this. Looking a little like we might have saved your skin. Think we're do a favor, hombre. Jesus, slow down, maybe. I'll get you, but kind of caught me at a bad time. We ever meet again, I'll have you covered. Bye, Brick. You're welcome. Remember, one of my playthroughs, I uh, blew him up. Because I wasn't aware of what I was doing. I'm like, oh, yeah, let's just set off these charges. Boom! <laughs> oh, whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Fuckers. 
Getting burned to fuck. Turn off camera. There it is. Turn off camera. Speaking of which, before we do much else, um, equip that with the armor, anything there, nothing there, no, no, character, Grab those. So it'll be more DPS going out. Um, where is that one? Oh, there it is. Turn off. to get everything I can before I leave loot goblin, you know. Target analysis. Okay. We're not all bad, you know. Let's talk. The fuck? Come on. There you go, Jackie.
be changing how quick that works too. I'm probably, honestly. It wouldn't surprise me if they do. button I wanted but whatever uh... there we go literally not what I wanted I wanted to turn off on the same person, but I don't know. Huh. That'd be cool. Playtime's over! Fuck! Jackie, you're fine. Oh, you can see him from there. Interesting. I literally didn't know that. Alright, well, where is your... There isn't. Okay. Bit. Come on, you fuckers. Come here. <laughs> yes, it is personal because you're trying to kill me. <gasps> the fuck you think? Before we do, <laughs> that was on accident, actually, but it worked out. You never know if your enemies are still alive. Lottery scratch card, some bounce backs, grenade, which I rarely ever fucking use in the first place. survivors <laughs> well yes and no I'm also looting so I just want um, I want to have all the things if 
I can have the things, I'm going to have all the things. Come on, V. Let's get out of here. <sighs> Milladek. They got those things buzzing around everywhere. Past the gate. We can talk there. Maelstrom, huh? Never ends well, does it? Looks like you two lucked out a bit. And you? Why are you here? Well, including I heads. Yeah. Still don't know who the mole is. I was hoping the Maelstromers would shed some light on it. Yeah, I doubt that. Rather tough to get corpses to talk. You'd be surprised. I'm sure I'll manage something. It's been a pleasure. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. We make a good team, Jack. I think you might be right. In any case, I don't regret switching my life up the way I did. Well, that'd be the sweet taste of success, my friend. Hey, call up Dex, let him know we got his toy. Meeting to celebrate at the afterlife. How you luego, V? Things looking, Miss V. Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Boys couldn't give in two shits that you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You used the corporal woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch for Maelstrom. So you paid for the flathead with corp cash? No. Decided I could use the Eddies myself. And I just grabbed the bot. Just like that? Not just. Had to use violence. You got some balls, Miss V. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Miss V. Level six. Hi, oh, yeah. Uh, we'll go reflexes or body. Uh, we'll go body. Um, I also need cool as well. Um, Level seven. Um, All right, we might as well sell all the things we do not need. So junk, yes. I really don't need grenades, so it's just extra money at this point. Not a lot of extra money, but extra money nonetheless. Good weapon. But not what I'm after.
Um, threat detector at. There we go. Two grand's worth. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate you. We do have anonymous follows here, so you can continue lurking. Um. Okay. Curious. One point four kilometers on foot, no thank you. But I will at the very least um see what things have got for me. Boing boing boing. <laughs> do this to upgrade my, uh, athletes. <laughs> As I say that, my athletes gets experience. It's really annoying, but it's better than just I thought you were just having fun. Well, I mean, you know, <laughs> if the shoe fits. <laughs> Probably make me fucking vomit doing this too much, though. Just because it's a lot of fucking bouncing. It would either make me vomit or give me a headache, one of the two. Both? Both. <laughs> Por que no los dos? Why not both? <laughs> I said 1.4k miles running. No, thank you. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm running 1.4k miles. <laughs> uh. Bonk! <laughs> I 
Euro bucks um, for the baseball bat, even though we're not going to use it. Pretty katana. Try to say it to the katana animation, but there was none. Ah. <laughs> I've gotten a few um well timed um audios in my stream so it's uh quite a common theme <laughs> which honestly i'm happy about uh shards you okay It's funny, this early on in the game, you're so fucking squishy. When you try to go melee, you are so fucking squishy. Cable Spark. I just wanted to let you know in case you weren't aware. Um, I do stream daily. Um, I don't have a set time because my She's life really back. doesn't. Uh, well, let that sit. Oh, an ad. Whoops. All right. Yeah, I'll wait then. Definitely don't want to be dealing with that. saying right um so i in in case if you weren't aware um i do stream daily um bar fridays usually i don't have a set time currently but um that's just kind of due to my life with um my father and my dog um but i've been streaming at night because it's been hot during the day um but when it gets cooler out then i'll probably stream as and when but it'll still be daily um and all of my vods i do upload to youtube so um they are on my youtube channel down in the description as well um about time chica so if anyone misses a stream they can always watch it there if they want to What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. <laughs> Whatever. Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. More I tell her this shit, okay. I'm out. <laughs> Fuck this like shit, I'm out. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Don't mind me. But I'ma just grab my stuff tomorrow. and leave. Excuse Sometimes. me, please. Baby. <laughs> yeah. Funny. How you doing tonight, Luck? 
For a club with the hottest contracts in town, doesn't look like all it's bigged up to be. It's what's inside that counts, Chum. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. When proper burials were still a thing. Good lurking playing, lol. Fair. And who might you clowns be? We're friends of Dexter Deshaun. He's expecting us. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. This is it. Heart of Night City. That's it right there. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All set on those two. Looks like we're up. Lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. Duo of Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. It's like the dog ate mine. <clears throat> Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. Say I wanted to have a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Die. Snuff it. Mind blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. Stein's a small price to pay for going down in history. Gotta live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Tonight, city. And the afterlife! Ha <laughs> ha! I didn't go with to this. Oh, this by the time. way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer, oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Deshaun, see you now. Dex a regular? He come here a lot? A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Mm -hmm. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. <laughs> How do you know? My job to know. Look around. How do you think mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Fair. Break a leg. Thanks. This way. Damn, Holmes. You're huge. Work out? No. Mm. Same here. No, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? Mm. Think you could take me? Drop me? In here. Yes, they pinch it, people. A leg. <laughs> That's right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies, as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it 
Saint Miss V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Let's see this bad boy. All right, then. Set your butts down comfy. Thanks for your help back at the scav hunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Miss V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza, inside, in that raw BD she spoiled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target. Yorinobu Arasaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? Parker chick? <laughs> I don't know. Sent out mixed signals, so I got mixed feelings. One night, sipping Sean parody with Yorinobu. Next night, chatting it up with regulars at Lizzie's. Worlds don't match up. Struck me, too. You saying we putting two and two together and getting five? Some part of the equation's missing, then. Clearly. That's why y'all gotta fix her. Anyone try to fuck you? They first gotta fuck their way through Dex to Sean's 300-pound ass. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> Think she just wanted to see what I was about. Wanted to see what she was about, huh? How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Devs? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. Adela Main will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. It goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. How do we get in the penthouse? Yarnobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Konpeki's dweller, elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? <laughs> Trust me when I say whatever hits you think of, T-Bug solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to... take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more, what's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Hannah Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. Case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? Transport to Delamain. Primus cab company in all night city. Not a mile. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. <laughs> if everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. 
If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The no-tell motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? Okay. Feel brought up to speed? Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Cut for fresh talent's always the same and non-negotiable. 30%. Bro, 30? Every part in this drama carries its risks. That's the value of yours, as determined by me. Hello? Come on, Dex. Isn't that a little low? Hey, hold on, Holmes. Who got the flathead? Who pulled the intel from the brain dance? And we're going in a hotel full of soccer men to swipe some fucking toy from the boss's son. We are the job. Hmm. And who's providing transport? A top-tier net runner and a lead-proof plan and intel? You sure you want to go down this road? Go on now. Don't be shy. Fine, Dex. Made your point. Wise choice. Last thing. Kompeki's got a strict no-iron policy. Security gates. The works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part, too. Chido. Thanks, T. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week, two tops is my guess. And what do we do while waiting? Sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, cause old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet. So don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta Two. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues, now's your chance. You and Dex known each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, peeps say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophizing. No wonder you get along. Plan. What's your take? Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. I'm good. No questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. Just don't forget to suit up. All right, that's going to be it for me for the night, guys. I need to get some sleep, but I will be back tomorrow. Hopefully we'll get the heist done and uh, go from there. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you for the lurks, the subs, the follows. I appreciate you. I love you. I will see you guys all tomorrow. Have a good night. I'll see you later.